In 1914, Port Angeles, Washington was a city on the rise, not necessarily only financially, but out of the mud flats and the tide pools of Port Angeles Harbor. Behind us, you'll see the wall that depicts how high the actual city fill was done in 1914. The process of slushing the hogback is quite an adventure in itself. When you're walking in the downtown area of Port Angeles today, it's hard to imagine that that city was actually anywhere from 6 to 15 feet lower than it is today. The buildings look like they're sitting on solid ground, but they're actually not. 99.9% .9 of the buildings in the downtown area are raised up off the ground and put on post and beam. The Port Angeles downtown area is filled with history. The Family Shoe Store is one of the buildings that is probably one of the most famous of our downtown historic buildings. It was jacked up off the ground with great big screw jacks and set back down on post and beam and raised up off the ground. Part of the tour has taken place in the Family Shoe Store and it has quite a raucous little history to it. You'll enjoy that portion of the tour. At one time you could walk from one end of Port Angeles to the other without ever poking your head above ground. There are places where you can still walk underneath that ground and that's part of what we show you on the tour. Let's take a step back in time and walk down the steps to the underground of Port Angeles. As we look back in history, we walk up to the windows that used to look out to the sidewalk that used to be down here, which is now up there. In 1914, Endeavor was taken to raise the city of Port Angeles. And it was an endeavor that the whole town got involved in. We have the remnants of what's there now. As we walk, look out these windows, we can imagine what our forefathers looked at. This was the sidewalk. You used to look across the street at the Aldwell building. We have what's left of the debris from what is the sidewalk forms that they did in 1920 when they made the concrete sidewalks that created the underground. It's quite a picture to see. We have the skylights up above, and as we speak, the person just walked across the skylight. You can actually see the physical body walking across. As I look out the window at where the sidewalk used to be, it can't help but get a little chill running down your spine just to realize what our forefathers went through that made the fascinating story of the Port Angeles Underground. Take a historic walk and learn a little bit about Port Angeles and the downtown area with a visit to the underground.